Hello everyone, happy to see you here and welcome back to my channel Mathematics channel with really interesting, different and relaxing questions. And in this video we have this question, we have 4 plus 4 plus 4 and times 0. On the first side this is a very simple question, yeah, we don't have any huge numbers, we have only 4, we have addition, we have multiplication, so it's not like thousands right here, we don't have any square roots, we don't have any fourth, fifth power, we have only a regular number, integer, and right here we have addition, we have multiplication. So very interesting entry question. Right here on the left hand side we have a lot of options so you can easily check your algebra skills, check your school knowledge right here because this is an easy question but a lot of students do this common mistake and, want, and I wanted to record this video, I want to explain how can you solve this correctly. So pause the video and try to solve it by yourself, just trust me, it will be really interesting to check our answers here in just two minutes. So A, B and C. Ok, I hope you solve it and right now let's try to solve it together. So here is our question, we have four plus 4, plus 4, and times 0. One part of students saw it like that. From school they know that doesn't matter what number you have on the left hand side, if you multiply this number by 0, for example you have like 100 times 0, the answer is 0, for example you have 5 times 0, the answer is 0, so doesn't matter what number do you have on the left hand side, a correct answer is 0 right here, yeah? But let's look at this question. One part of students think that uh, right here we can easily solve it in the same way, we have like addition right here, if you add it, we can multiply it by 0, the answer is 0. Right here we have this option, so it looks like a correct answer is option A. But here is the first approach, and I don't want to tell that this is correct or incorrect, let's look at this in another perspective, because right here we have addition and multiplication. So we need to know what is the correct order to do this problem. We have addition and multiplication, do we need to start with, with multiplication or addition or this addition, because obviously whatever order of operation we select is going to create a different answer, right? So we need to understand what is the correct order to do this problem, yeah? And for this question I have this PMDMC order of operation. For, for example, let's solve it according to this order of operation. I know when I respect every order of operation, for example Bodmas, I respect it, but uh, with Bodmas, with PMDMC, we'll have the same answer, so doesn't matter in our case. So we have 4 plus 4, I just wanted to rewrite this question, so 4 plus 4 plus 4 and times 0. Let's solve it according to PMDMC and let's check this answer uh, with this 0. Maybe we'll have the same answer, I don't know exactly, but let's check it, this answer. So this is from our head, from our brain, this is, we solve this problem as we type it in, but right here let's look at this uh, in this perspective. Let's apply this PMDMC order of operation. So this PMDMC works from the top to the bottom and now we need to scan. What is the first step according to PMDMC? The first step according to PMDMC is parentheses. Now we need to scan, where do we have this parentheses right here? Let's look at it. I don't see any parentheses, so it's really great, we can easily skip this first step, so we don't have any parentheses, it is, it is really great. Because with parentheses, if it's like more complicated question, we have uh, complicated expressions, we don't have parentheses, and it's really great. The next step, according to PMMC, the next step is exponents, our exponents. Yeah, so we can easily skip this part because we don't have any exponents right here. We don't have any cubes, we don't have any huge powers, we don't have any four squares uh, or whatever. Yeah, right here we have only four, which is, which is really great. Ok, let's go to the next step, we just keep this two part, which is really good, and let's go to the next step. Next step according to PMDMC is multiplication. Yeah, but a lot of students do this common mistake, they forget about division, but we need to remember it, because multiplication and division, this is one common group. So we need to scan multiplication and division sign from left to right real quick. Let's look at it. Addition, this is not cover case, addition, and right here we have multiplication in the end. So we don't have division, which is really great, and we have multiplication. So the first step is to multiply this 4 times 0. Ok, so we have 4 plus 4 and plus 4 times 0, as I told before, wherever you have number on the left hand side, if you multiply by 0, you have every time you have 0. So, very simple addition, and addition, this is our last step with subtraction, so this is one, one common group, so we can easily, we can easily add it, very simple addition, we have 4 plus 4 equal to, equal to 8, option, option B. And here is our main question, which is what is number, which, uh, what uh, option is correct? 
8, option B, or 0, option A? Of course, here's our question, here's our answer. Right here, correct answer, of course, is 8, because we solve it according to a correct order of operation, and in our case, this is PMDMC. This is absolutely wrong solution, absolutely wrong, forget this solution, because it's not work like that. You need to know about order of operation, you need to multiply it first, then you need to add it, as I, as I showed before. Right here, we have multiplication before addition and subtraction, then multiplication before. But here's our trick right here. If you put parentheses right here, then you can easily say that zero is a correct answer because you start from parentheses, which is really great. You will have like 12 times zero equal to equal to zero. Yeah, so, but right here we don't have any parentheses. So the correct answer is option, 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 option B. Yeah, so our answer our answer option B is a correct answer to this question. So I hope you understand this explanation, but definitely don't feel bad if you got this wrong. I hope you understand this uh, solution and I have a lot of interesting questions, so you can easily look at it or you can easily solve this question on my channel. So see you in the next videos and have a great day.